Hello! So in this recipe I'm going to be making a tempeh katsu curry. Now watch my first video to see how to prepare the tempeh. Let's go! So here we've got the ingredients. We've got the prepared tempeh, we've got the curry powder, we've got the tamari soy sauce, the peanut butter, the rice wine vinegar, the coconut milk, We've also got some shallots, some garlic, cinnamon, ginger and red chilies. Let's go! I'm going to be adding some of this olive oil to the pan. Now I'm going to be adding all the onion and ginger and chilies into it. Go. Yeah, a nice stir. We're adding the cinnamon. Keep stirring it, let it release all that fantastic aroma of the chilies and the shallots and the ginger. Don't burn it, soften it in the pan and let it cook gently. Cook it for about five minutes or so. What an aroma, that's absolutely incredible. It smells so good. So next I'm gonna add some curry powder to this. Add about a tablespoon worth. There you go. I'm gonna add some tamari soy sauce. Next I'm gonna add some rice wine vinegar. Next, I'll be adding some coconut milk. Next, I'm going to be adding some peanut butter. It's going to bring out that fantastic curry flavour. So here I go. So I'm going to give it a quick taste to see um, how it's turned out. Oh, that's so good. Absolutely incredible. It just needs a pinch of sugar to bring out the sweetness. And I'm going to add some fresh coriander. Just tear it up and chuck it. So that's our katsu sauce ready. And now I'm going to add the tempeh pieces that I created earlier. and gently in the sauce. Make sure each and every tempeh piece is beautifully coated in that absolutely delicious sauce. Plating up the katsu curry now. It smells absolutely amazing. Really delicious. So we're going to into a dish over here. Now I'm going to create a little bed of herbs like that and I'm going to pour the rice on top of that. Some white rice. I'm going to sprinkle some beautiful black sesame seeds. And I'm going to sprinkle some torn coriander on the katsu. And I'm going to decorate it with some beautiful wood sorrel flowers that I've just picked from the garden. Here you go, that's your finished dish of katsu curry using tempeh with some beautiful white rice sprinkled with black sesame seeds.